I've had some people ask me how I managed to power on my Li-Fi 4000 unit here. Um, anybody that's messed with one would have noticed that just uh, applying power to it doesn't do anything. And so I'm going to do a little demo here. Um, there's a little connector on the inside there on the top. It's next to the big power connector. That one, if you can see it right there, it's a little five pin connector and basically all you need to do is just apply anywhere from I've tested it down at 3.3 volts up to 5 on the second from the left up on top there and then you just need a like a ground like I, I have here um, I have a little 5 volt power supply that I'm going to use to do that and that goes it's going to connect into that there I'm going to apply the grounds already connected but I'm going to plug in the positive and the only other thing I have here is 12 volts going to the to the fan to cool the puck inside the unit so that power supply is set to 12 volts and this is the main power supply for this unit which I actually got with it and this provides about 28 volts at like 10 amps or so I believe um, when I first started messing with this I didn't have the proper connector to plug into that there but I did have the small one that's it's a two position connector and it actually fits in there just fine and so I set it so that it's the second one from the so it's the second one from the left there so that one I just plug into there and it's fine I actually found this connector later on when I took this little camera module out of an HP laptop it has the exact same size connector on there except that I would have to rearrange this for it to work on here so I haven't messed with that yet but um, let's go ahead and power this on so that's the, that's the main power there and then this one here I'm going to plug into the mains How's that and plug this one in for the 5 volt that and then as you can see once you apply 5 volts, and there it goes. And it's on. Oops, forgot to turn the fan on. There it is. So, that's pretty much all there is to it. Uh, there's a software and a kit available from Luxum that allows you a bit more control over this and I guess supposedly it plugs into that that data connector there and it allows you to read like the temperatures and it allows you to dim the lamp and like stats and things like that I'm not I don't remember exactly what all it does and I kind of wanted to get my hands on that but I haven't been able to but other than that I mean if I just wanted to turn on I can do that all right thanks for watching